seeing it. Now at least she feels able to join in, taking on Matthew in an assertive training exercise. What's the problem? Um, the problem is he took my pen. No, you took my pen. Oh, okay. Calm down, calm down. Who am I going to give this pen back to? To me, because it took mine. No, Is it hers, Matthew? It's mine. Jen has the truth. What can you say? I would say to him something like, don't you look at me like that. You're not going to bully me. No, you're going to bully me by doing that. Go on, tell him you're not going to listen to bully you. Don't look at me like that. Why? I'm not frightened of you. Yes, no, I'm not frightened. <laughs> you should be, because I'm a... Because I'm a man. <laughs> That's fantastic. But keep going. The change in somebody like Bina was was so heartwarming. It was just so phenomenal. From a person that doesn't speak at all to somebody who will come up and have a little chat, however small it is. The head is still dealing with the Mark Hall case. New allegations have been made by pupils against Mark. Do you know anything about the incidents with Mark Hall? Yes. What do you know? Well, it was drama that he's uh, threatened Chris that he had to Pay seven pounds fifty. Otherwise, it'd be wrong. Did you hear that? Yes. And in Corbyn, um, when we had Ari, he smacked him in the face a couple of times. Not you. Well, he's hit me a couple of times, but it's Chris mainly. I see. Right. Okay. You didn't. You didn't ever find out what this seven pounds fifty was for. Well, he said it's protection for, against him beating Chris up. Did you hear him say that? Yeah. You heard him say it's yeah. protection? Yeah. He said it's protection money, so I won't beat you up. I'm supposed to be stealing money stealing off of Stealing money off of people, which I know is not true. What, why do you say that? Well, because Mark has his own bank account. He has money that I leave for him every morning. And there's no reason for him to go and demand money off of other people. We've spoken to pupils who say that Mark was asking kids for money. Is that totally and utterly untrue? Yeah. I don't care what they say, because most of it's load of lies anyway that school come out with. I think he said something about me uh, giving some money to him. Yeah. But I thought it was just a joke, because he was just he was laughing at it. He told me to give him like, £20 or something like that. You scared of him? Yeah. Most people are scared of him. So you're a bit nervous about telling me this? Yeah. Because you think he might get his own back? Yeah. I see. What can I do to make you not nervous then? I do feel that they have got their favourites and they label them. And he's been labelled. Parents evening for year 10. In a school with high academic standards, the news will be good for most parents, but not all. If she keeps working this way, she'll be OK. Good. I'm really pleased. So am I. <laughs> I am concerned about his written work, because, because in a nutshell, he's not doing it. Mark has made a wonderful start. He really has. I've been so impressed by him. Well, yeah. He's very pleasant. Yeah. As long as you don't disturb him too much. <laughs> <laughs> For John's mother, the news is disheartening. Seven weeks after her meeting with the school, nothing has improved. It's been bad, hasn't it? There are some good points, but there are not very good. As I was leaving, he said, Mum, you better take a pillow. I said, what for? He said, to cry on. I said, is it that bad? He went, no, only joking. We've had problems with him losing his books. Right. Every t is, is exercise book. And every time I've given him a new exercise book, he's put it somewhere in the classroom and it's gone missing. Do you think you brought up your son correctly? Yeah, I do. Mm. But obviously I haven't, have I? Because something's wrong. Part of the time is distracting others in the room. Not necessarily deliberately. But it's got that manner that kind of means that everybody else is on edge. Do you intimidate some pupils, do you think? Not really. Only, I do a few. The people I've had fights with and I've won. I suppose I do intimidate them a little bit. I think he's trying to be tough. Um, 
to prove to people that he, he can bully them or whatever it is. I don't know. Um, I mean, even at home, he's like it. I mean, if it turned the other way and they were onto John, John would run. Um, definitely. It's just getting that across to him. I think back about all my mistakes and something, oh, I don't care. What I've, what's done, what's done. But other things, I think, oh, damn, what did I do that for? How do you think his school life will end 